Discord is a messaging platform where teens can join servers with various channels. It's popular in gaming but can expose teens to explicit content. To help keep kids safe online, be sure to watch our video today. First of all, let's set up Discord inbuilt privacy controls. Open Discord on your child's phone. Tap the profile icon. Go to Settings. Then tap Privacy and Safety. Under DM Spam Filter. Select Filter All Direct Messages. This setting can automatically scan and delete any DMs your kid receives that may contain spam content. Then scroll down to Server Privacy Defaults and toggle off Allow Direct Messages from Server Members. The setting won't be applied retroactively to existing servers. It'll be applied when your child joins a new one. Last, go to Friend Requests. Deselect every option to prevent anyone from easily messaging your child. While still allowing your child to chat in public channels. Along with privacy controls, parents can monitor their kids' Discord activity using the app's parental features. Open Discord, go to Settings. Tap Family Center. Then click Connect with Teen. Have your child's Discord account ready and scan the QR code. After scanning, tap Send Connection Request. If you're not sure how to find the QR code, just open your child's Discord. Go to Settings, Family Center, and tap Connect with Parent to display it. Ask your child to accept the invitation. Once that's done, you'll be able to monitor their Discord usage, including new friends added, users they've called, services joined, and active servers. Discord parental controls are somewhat limited. If you want a deeper insight into your child's activity, you may need to use AirDroid Parental Control. This app gives parents a clear view of how much time their kids are spending on Discord with activity reports in today's event. It syncs instantly, sending notifications about any messages or calls on their kids' Discord. So parents can quickly check them out by tapping notifications. For real-time insights, they can tap screen mirroring to see their child's screen directly. Parents can also manage Discord use by setting time limits or downtimes in app limits. If they want to block the app entirely, they just head to App and Content Restriction App Blocker, find Discord, and block it. Plus, setting up keywords lets them spot harmful content, giving parents instant alerts if their child faces dangers or cyberbullying. Remember, even with these controls in place, it's essential to talk to your children about online safety. Remind them not to share any personal information with strangers. The more they know, the better they can protect themselves. We hope these solutions help you set up Discord parental controls and protect your child's online safety. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to our channel for more tips and tricks. Thanks for watching, and see you next time.